Today, thousands of people came out to celebrate the 50th annual Buena Vista Labor Day Parade. The event also kicks off political season in our region. 10 News reporter Annie Schroeder is working for you to show why this landmark occasion is such a milestone here in Virginia. With VMI's band leading the way, thousands came together to ring in Buena Vista's 50th Labor Day Parade. It's nice to see smiling faces and enjoying the day. Celebrations were canceled last year for the pandemic, but we're back in full swing Monday without skipping a beat. After, you know, COVID, everybody's, everybody's been, you know, shut in their house, and it's nice to see people out and about and enjoying the uh, patriotism and, and family. And while the parade is a fun event for the entire community, the event also marks the kickoff of political season here in Virginia. Several candidates were here this morning talking about where they stand just weeks before the November election. All members of the Republican Party on the statewide ticket took part in the event, including candidate for governor Glenn Youngkin. We're going to make Virginia the best state in America. Youngkin's opponent, Terry McAuliffe, spent his Labor Day at events in Northern Virginia, but Democratic Senator Creed Deeds was one of a handful of Democrats to show up. And I'm a Democrat, and, and I think over the long course of time, Democrats have done more for working people in this country and in this country. With less than two weeks until the election this November, each candidate also made a push to the polls. Annie Schroeder, 10 News, working for you.